power on and testing. Five, testing and making dumpling. Six, multifunction. Seven, problem and resolving. Eight, notices. Nine, recipe of dumplings. Part one, construction and principle. The dumpling machine consists of five major parts with respective functions of feeding dough, feeding stuffing, forming dumpling, forming frame, and transmission devices. The working principle is that the dough fed into a dough bucket is pushed by a screw propeller to the exact nozzle. Thus, a dough pipe is formed. Then, the stuffing is pushed into the dough pipe by a two-stage variable wind pump. After being rolled and cut off by a special forming roller, the dumpling is made. The previous pro procedure achieved mainly by feeding dough, feeding stuffing, and forming dumpling. Feeding stuffing is that stuffing is pushed into the dough pipe, and the machinery of control stuffing volume consists of a stuffing bucket, stuffing propeller, stuffing tube, two-stage variable wind pump. Working of feeding dough part is that dough pipe with stuffing pressed and formed. It consists of a forming frame, a forming roller, a forming secondary roller, a tightness bolt, and a dry flour funnel. Part 2. Installation 1. Unpacking the package box and checking. Backup name. Starfing funnel, 1 pieces. Starfing propeller, 1 piece. Vibrating sieve, 1 piece. Dough shelf, one piece. C spanner, one piece. Operation instructions, one piece. Plastic pipe, two pieces. Nylon sleeve, two pieces. Fuse, two pieces. Tight circle, two pieces. Temper pin, two pieces. Two. The stuffing funnel is mounted on the pump frame, then stuffing propeller on the rotator, the vibrating sieve on its frame. Three, connecting power supply and earth line. Four, the dough sleeve uses water circular cooler. As temperature of the dough sleeve is over high, the cooler must be used. In case of the customer must self-equip a CX300A type water pump and water supply and connecting water pipes forming water circular cooler system. Part 3. Disassembly and clean and equipment for parts. Before or after the dumpling machine is used, it should be assembly and cleaned. To ensure cleaning, after clean, they are reassembled. 1. Disassembly and reassembly for the feeding dough part. Respectively, unscrew two nuts of dough exit counterclockwise with a C spanner. 2. Removing the internal nozzle and external a nut on the dough sleeve is unscrewed by C-spanner counterclockwise again. Removing dough sleeve, pull dough propeller out. Stuffing tube is turned counterclockwise and pull out removing secondary roll of feeding dough. The removed part proceeding to clean and dry. Also dough bucket to clean and dry, then reassembly.
reassembly is according to disassembly in opposite order. Disassembly and cleaning and reassembly for the feeding stuffing. The stuffing propeller is held with a hand and turned counterclockwise. Lift up and turn stuffing bucket out counterclockwise. In turn, removing the upper and the lower plate, rotator and vein, turn the control handle of stuffing volume out counterclockwise. Removing the core of the pump and unscrew the nuts of pump body. Removing the pump body, lower cover plant and all type circle. The removed parts proceeding to clean and reassembly. Reassembly is according to disassembly in opposite order. Cleaning the forming parts. Do not need to disassemble the part of the forming frame and may be clean then reassemble. Part 4. Switch on the power supply and test run. Before switch on, check up if the tated voltage and the phase order is suitable for supply connected with the machine. Turn the coupling handle to position off. Back the dough propeller to the rear and with C-type handle. After start machine checkup, if leakage it has, and see if the machine rotates in the right direction as marked. After the machine runs normally, about 3 to 5 minutes. When runs the Coupling handle is moved according to direction indicated and adjusted checkup if normal. When runs normally.
Part Five: Test Dumpling. One, test stuffing. Before Tai's dough, proceeding test stuffing. Pull out the set pan and turning the forming frame clockwise by ninety degrees. Fill the stuffing funnel. Turn the coupling handle to position on. Set the controlling handle to the required position. Start the machine. See if stuffing is even without interruption. When feeding stuffing normally, after runs about two minutes, turn coupling handle to the position off to stop feeding stuffing. Two, test dough pipe. Its purpose that is check up what's the volume of the dough and if the thickness of dough pipe is proper. First, push the dough propeller to proper position by adjusting the nut. Cut dough into five to seven centimeters wide of strips. Put some of strips into the dough bucket. After start, the dough pep is pressed out from the internal and external dough nozzle. Control dough volume is through adjusting nut to be achieved. As turn the nut clockwise, dough volume will increase. On the contrary, turn the nut counterclockwise. It will decrease. Dough pipe should be controlled at about one millimeter. The thickness of dough pipe adjusted is through to turn the nut to be achieved. Three dumpling wrapper. The dry flour funnel and lower dough tray are full of dry flour. Turn the coupling handle of feeding stuffing. To the position on, and the stuffing volume is proper through adjusting handle. Then start machine dumpling is made continuously. Dumplings out! How beautiful dumpling! It can not only make dumpling, also can make other wrapper food by changing different mold. Part six: Other food is wrapped or made with Mountain Goose machine. If by other forming mode of our factory, forming frame is replaced easily, disassembles forming frame of dumpling, replacing proper it, and replacing a little of parts. Mentioned food can be made. Samosa, spring roll, dumpling for fry, hundun, flour edge dumpling. Part seven. Generally occurred problems and resolving. One, dumpling breaks continuously after frying. The machine should be stopped immediately, and opening the forming frame is that some impurity is into internal nozzle. Should unscrew adjusting nut, increasing the thickness of dough pipe. After start machine, removing impurity. If do not remove it yet, should disassemble external nozzle, takes impurity out. To avoid that breaks, should check if there is impurity in dry flour and keep cleaning of flour mixing machine. Two, no dumpling is falling off. It may be three reasons. A, there is a few dry flour in dry flour funnel. B. The dry flour funnel may be blocked. C. Dumpling dough may be softer. To avoid that, the dry flour funnel should be full dry flour, and dry flour funnel is not blocked. Softness or hardness should be proper. Three, dumplings pass to each other because of more gap between the forming mold and the secondary roll. Should stop machine immediately. Should adjust the light screw properly. Turn down, but do not exceed. Otherwise, forming secondary roll may be broken. Four, dumpling short of edge. The reason is that a dough volume is not enough. Should turn adjusting nut of dough volume clockwise and adding dough volume properly.
V. Dry flour may leak out more than enough. She adjusts the controlling plant of dry flour funnel. Leak volume of dry flour is decreased by adjusting the but do not pass the forming mode. 5. Dumpling with wrinkles. Its more dough volume should adjust not to decrease properly dough volume. 6. Before start machine, the adjusting knot of dough pipe should be decreased degree of tightness. If dough pipe is too thick, it will adjust for thin again. In order to avoid the starting machine for tightly knot, the parts may be broken. One for new user. Combine CD disk detailed reading operation instructions. Familiar with operating method and technology. Two. Keep the machine while clean. After used, must clean. 3. When machine run operator do not contact and hit it with hands and other in order to avoid injuries and damage of machine. 4. Keep revolution parts in good condition. The exposed gear should be greased regularly and some bearings should be examined and repaired with grease every 6 months during maintenance. Series 8107 bearing of dope screw propeller wire every month. The oil sump should be drained and refilled with number 2240 mobile oil every three months. The oil level should be kept above the middle. If you encounter other problems, please feel free to contact us. Part 9 the recipes are as follows. 